Greetings and welcome back to Mini Motorways. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm delighted to tell you that I have been sponsored by the devs of Mini Motorways to play two episodes for you featuring the brand new modes that are Endless Mode, which is a really chill way to relax and just develop your city and build it any way you want without any pressures at all. And then there's Expert Mode, which is a bit unforgiving. It's pretty hardcore. Um, so I think today what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to go over Endless Mode and also Challenge Mode, which I don't think I've covered on the channel before, but you have to do it to get to expert. So I'm really excited about that. But first of all, I want to share with you some very important tips and tricks for getting the best high scores in this game. So the very first one is never use traffic lights. Don't even bother to take them. They may seem like a good idea at the time, but they really slow down your traffic. Next one, segregate the colors. Try to build um, roadways that connect pink, uh, pink houses to pink buildings, um, the consumers of the pink cars, you know, yellow goes with yellow, blues goes with blue and that kind of thing. And that will help your traffic situation massively. Leave houses off the main road. What you want to do is make sure you cluster your houses so that they're all kind of connected to one sort of node or nexus and then have that one long road connect to the uh, the main building where their destination is. Because if you have tra uh, houses on the main road, they do cause disruptions as cars leave the houses. All you need is two to four houses per, per demanding building, per destination. You really don't need much more than that. You can probably even do with one if they're very, very close. Uh, you do not have to connect all the houses, so don't worry about that. The building that's demanding the cars is the one in charge. The houses, they're, they're basically gamers. They're homebodies. They don't need to leave the house. They're fine. Thank you very much. It's the buildings that have passengers that need to go home. That is the thing you need to worry about. So you want to use as many motorways as possible. Those are those like big bridgey thingies that can go pretty much across the entire map. They are very fast. They take cars very quickly across the map as well as kind of fly over every other kind of roadway. They're really, really good. Lastly, prevent AI placements with extra roads. So this is like, you know, hardcore tip here. Um, if you don't want uh, demanders to show up next to other demanding buildings like in, and they're sharing the same road, sometimes that happens. The AI is pretty naughty. They want to create difficult situations for you. Put extra roads down uh, to prevent the AI from placing stuff there. Um, and another tip I forgot to put on here, use diagonals because they move essentially two squares only using one road tile. All right, so why don't we get started and play? Now, on, in order to unlock, so I have been playing um, Tokyo, um, and but I want to show you, let's see, in Beijing, let's go to the, the modes here. So you have classic, endless is automatically unlocked for you, and then you have expert mode. And expert says, you need to complete 600 trips in any challenge in this map to unlock expert mode. So that's what we're going to do first. We're going to go to do a challenge. Um, we have two, two different kinds. We have mega city, which we can click on these things to find out what it means. Get it straight. Diagonal roads require double the amount of road tiles. Oh, naughty. They're trying to fake us out here. Destinations are more likely to be double destinations. That is not great. <laughs> Let's see what this one is. The long and winding roads, straight roads require double the amount of road tiles. Wow. Okay. Merry-go roundabouts, unlimited roundabouts. Hello. All destinations are circles. That means that they require lots and lots of traffic. We can try this. We can try this. Let's go uh, for round and round and round. We'll go ahead and pick that one. Okay. There we go. End play. Yes. Start a new city. Yes. I'm ready. Let's go. Let's do this. We need 600 trips to unlock endless or uh, expert mode. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go ahead and just connect these. Um, Wait, did they say... Oh God, I forgot the, the thing. Was it the straight tiles that required... Yeah, two road tiles. But we can do something quite naughty and do this. Oh, that was bad. Don't do that. This is so weird. I've never done this before. <laughs> It's very silly. <laughs> All right, I'm going to turn it to max speed here. Okay, and so here's where we were creating this neighborhood. 
trying to kind of create a little bit of a nexus here. This is so bizarre. <laughs> so bizarre. Okay, so but I do want to create maybe extra road tiles here. Let's just do that. We can always remove these if we want to. We just don't want another building to place itself right here because that would be very not great. The long and windy road, indeed. That's a bit hilarious. Okay. Okay, we have another new place here. Let's go ahead and put this one like this. Uh-huh. Oh, ran out of roads. Okay, we got to delete some of these. Oops, let's get back that one. Let's go ahead and put this one on here. Uh, and maybe this one. So we have three on each building. I think that's going to be okay, I hope. Okay, and then there's this one. This is a bit far away. We have zero road tiles right now. This is not good. It's going to be a bit difficult. Oh my god. Okay. This is extra difficult. Uh-huh. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I think I kind of want to do a roundabout here-ish. We actually need one here. I think that's where we need it. And let's connect this one here. Like that. And then we'll connect these guys going out that way. But we don't have road. Nope, ain't got no road. Uh, we might be able to make it to Sunday. There we go. Bridge. Okay, we'll take that. Okay, so there is this. Uh-huh. Okay, this is... This is already extremely naughty game. Game, why you do? But you see, these other ones are surviving very well with three houses each. We don't need to connect these two at all. Hmm. All right. Okay, game. What else are you going to throw my way? Hopefully the rest of the roads are a bit... Let's just move. Let's do a couple more. Like, I don't want roads or buildings ending up here. Not really. I don't want to crowd these roads because already we've had to mix these roads and that is not ideal. <gasps> wow. Why? Okay. All right. We might be able to do something here. Kind of go as far as we can here. And then, oh, no, 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 no. I meant to do this. Maybe we can do that. Or maybe we just put in a roundabout there. I think that's probably better. Let's put that one in that direction. So we have minimal disruptions to the main line here. Okay, this one is facing the wrong direction. Oh, what do we do with this one? We could put that on the roundabout, maybe, this one. Wait, no, not there. There, please. And I think I'm going to leave this one alone. We have three. That should be enough. But I don't want to disrupt the main road with this thing. Let's just take 30 road tiles. Okay. Everything is going pretty well. Blue, if it catches up too much, we might add that extra house. But so far, I think it's going to be okay. I'm going to put this one out. Mm-hmm. Because pink is doing just fine the way it is. Let's see. Just block that one off there. And let's block this area off as well. All right. Yeah, expert mode, I have to say, is pretty hardcore. You can't change your decisions. Like, when you put a road down, you have, I think, something like 30 seconds or a minute. I didn't time it. Um, but then it like solidifies and you cannot erase your roads anymore. So that's going to be a fun one to explore tomorrow. Um, we're pretty excited. I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, really excited 
Huge thank you to, to the devs for sponsoring this. I really love Mini Motorways. It's such a fun game. And uh, I'm always delighted to, to feature it on my channel because it really is a very, it's simple, but it's high, high quality game with a lot of gameplay. So it's uh, it's definitely a game worth checking out. Um, it's It's been a really nice, it's, it's one of these really nice like casual games that you can, okay, this is fun. Uh, <laughs> that you can just play and play uh, when you have a few minutes of time or or whatever. It's it's pretty cool. This is getting kind of thick here. I'm a bit worried about this. We can do uh, this. We can add one extra house here. Uh, mm, now this one, we have to do something like this. Okay. Alternatively, we could add these on a motorway instead. Okay, and then let's add some protection or something here like that. These other things are getting quite... Jeez, there's a lot of traffic here. Let's take this one off. That's fine. Whoops. Okay, these, these buildings are getting awfully naughty here. I don't know. They are going really fast. That's not usual. Not usual for them to, like, build up that fast. It's a bit scary. Okay, we have lots of traffic starting to build up here. All right, now we have new problems. <laughs> so this, I think, deserves our motorway. It's quite far. So the way you do it is you build that motorway first. Um, and then drag the icon across. And then you can uh, connect them up. But but this is a very long distance, so it's really good to have quick speed here. Okay, that doesn't go anywhere. Okay, this one can connect there. Alright, nice. They're all just placing themselves in exactly the right spots. Okay, so so far we're doing pretty good. We're getting a number of trips. We're almost halfway there. Okay, let's do a bridge. I always like to get the extra thing, whatever it might be, like bridges or extra road tiles. You can see there's a little bit more water. So when the map zooms out, um, as it does periodically, uh, to, for us to get more tiles to play with, um, we're going to need more bridges. Ah, nice. Okay, this is... This is even more fun. Okay. Um, we can take this this way. It looks like it's not giving us much opportunity for... Oops. Okay, let's try that. And we can do that one in. Maybe this one. there to get a little bit of traffic down here and yeah, that's a good placement okay ah and then blue okay this we'll face that one downward this is such a funny like the squiggly road thing is kind of hilarious <laughs> just slightly hilarious jeez okay Not much to do there. It's kind of a big penalty for using straight roads. Okay, we're doing well. We're over 300 now. All the different colors. And these, these two can be connected down this way. Potentially. Oh boy. Okay. Or not. Okay. Now these guys got a choice of where they want to turn in. Not going to be able to connect these guys unless I put a roundabout in here somewhere to connect them down. But we only have nine road tiles and it doesn't feel like we have enough. I'll take another motorway. Motorways are so great.
Yeah, these kind of ended up in a really weird little fashion here. So I'm just going to make minimal number of road disruptions there. Okay, this one doesn't look like it's getting too many. Let's add that one that way. I forgot to check out that one. We don't... Yeah, we have these two, but... Eh. I could put in a roundabout there. Do we need them? those cars. I fear that these cars are going to go to this building sometimes and I really don't want that. That would be a bad, bad thing. Okay, so we have a new thing. I think this deserves a motorway. I think it's far enough to warrant it. So we'll take this and go down here. All right. I guess we could do this even, just connect it directly. Okay, there we go. Ah, now we have some more cars. More houses appearing. Do we need these? We might. We might actually need these. Nope. Whoops. I'm gonna do this. Okay, there we go. That one has four. That seems good. Motorway again. Absolutely. All the motorways all the time. Go for them. All the motorways. This one is looking quite, quite not ideal here. I might take a motorway and ship them to here. Like if we could do this, yeah, that might be better. Let's do a motorway here. Let's take this road off completely. Put a motorway here. Come on, give it here. Okay, let's put this here and then go this way. And we'll take away all of these things and just do a diagonal there. And these guys can go up here uh, to this one. And this one can go down this way. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay. We're almost to 600, though. So we're doing pretty well. Oh, this one's filling up really fast. Ay, ay, ay. This one. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I forgot to connect this one. Oh, this is going to be bad. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Let's see if we can get there in time. We have many yellow cars racing to go get passengers. Oh, no. I might have just messed that up. That is not good. Let's see. Do that. Okay, I think we've solved that crisis. This one and that one. Those are kind of thick, though. I don't know about these. I think those are okay. It's kind of hard to see this one here. Let me just do that so we can kind of see this one a little bit better. The sound effects of this remind me of a little bit about Astroneer. Uh, boop -boop booms and... Uh... I don't know, it's like the, when you collect the, um, the materials from the landscape, they make this kind of like dinging sound a bit like that. Oopsies, okay. Oh, this is getting very thick here too. Do we have another motorway? We do not. Shoot. Um, hmm. Here, we would need to do Oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's fun. This, I almost feel like we need another... Uh, um, a motorway to get these two houses in here. It shouldn't really be that big of a deal, but for some reason the uh, cars are not coming, and it's probably because of the lack of parking slots there. Oh, this is fun. Um... Right. 
Do we have enough here? Okay, can we do this? Okay, can we go this way? Let's see if that will help us. Let's turn that one off. Nope. You're not allowed. Not allowed. I believe that one can go there. Nope. Okay, that's working. All right. Hmm. That should be enough, I think. Unless we were to, like, go ahead and build another enclave kind of thing here. No more roads. No. Sad times. Bridges. We have a little bit more in the roadway of things. Okay. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. Okay. Pretty happy about how this is working here. Okay, looking really excellent. This is a bit, <laughs> getting a bit thick here, but it should be fine. It should be fine. All right, this is exciting. This is very, very exciting. Nice. I'm very, very gratified about what is happening here with stuff. Except this is very thick. Why so thick? I think it has to do with having very few parking spaces. I think they can probably only leave when there's a parking space free. It looks like they almost always leaving like groups of three. Oh, the pink. Why, why pink? Hello? Oh no, I forgot about the pink. Oh, I didn't notice it there. Oh dear. Uh, we might have a slight issue. Slight, very slight, very, very slight. Uh, let me add that one. These guys can go over there. Oh, we might lose. We might lose. Oh, my bad. I didn't see that one appear. No, we're going to lose. <laughs> uh, this is not ideal. Okay, it's taking them off. Taking the stress off of it. Maybe, maybe. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Okay. Be going, it be going. Help. Oh, but this is this is really building up over here. This is definitely not a, a uh, not ideal. Let's see. This one has all these houses here. Um, I think what I want to do is I want to delete this road and delete this stuff, and let's put a motorway between there and there. Okay. So we want to get rid of this. We want to keep this one going that way. And then we'll add a motorway between these houses and this place. Yeah, I think that's better. Oh, okay. oh no. Whoops. Okay. Well, anyway, that's what we did. 1338 commuters. Not too bad. Let's um, go to the menu. So you can continue in endless mode. But what I'm going to do is let's go to the menu and we'll just start a brand new endless city so that you can see how that plays. So we did unlock expert, which we will do in the next episode, but let's go ahead and do endless. All right, here we go. So we start basically with a basic city um, as, uh, as before. We can do a bridge here. And remember, now we don't have that pressure of having silly, windy roads anymore. Uh, these are just normal placement tiles that we can get. Oh, we had four at a time. Interesting. Maybe one of them leaves after it's guaranteed that we will have one. Okay, so what happens is when you get a certain number of commuters, you get an upgrade. They don't do it weekly. Um, they do it... Um, based on, uh, I think it's like traffic throughput. Because if you notice this little meter, it's going to fill up as we get cars or as we deliver passengers. And then sometimes it sort of seems to go backward a bit. Let's see. Yep, it goes backward. So we're looking for through throughput here to have X amount of, you know, commuters per, per whatever period. 
and um, hopefully we'll get some new buildings soon so we can kind of build that up a tiny bit. Okay, so this one, let's do a roundabout here and we'll add this one there so that they can choose which destination they go to. And if some build closer to here, we'll just separate off the, uh, the roadways. But I think we did a good job with the last one, except for forgetting that the building spawned. I didn't even see it spawn. That was my bad. Wasn't paying attention well enough, I guess. Ah, hmm. Here we have an actual cross street. So I'm going to do a cross street instead. This is a T-junction here. And can I get that roundabout back? There we go. So this is an actual cross street. So we're going to just add this there. Uh, T-junctions are a little bit more forgiving. We could put a roundabout there if we wanted to. Um, let's see the, how the traffic behaves. It seems to be okay for now. Okay, this one goes there. And to flip these houses, just click on them and then just choose a, a movement direction. That's how I'm flipping them around. You can have them face whatever. Oh, whoops. No, 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 not that. Not that. You can have them face kind of any different direction you want. And the single road tile that comes out of them, they're like driveway. That's a free road tile. Okay. Looking good. We're doing very well here. Yeah, so never use a traffic light. You always, always rather have a roundabout if you need to cross streets uh, or even a, oh dear, oh dear. Uh, <laughs> or uh, a motorway is actually better. Okay, this is interesting. We'll just do this. This is not ideal. We'll probably try to segregate these off uh, whenever we get a motorway. Because having all of these different cars on the same uh, roadway is not ideal for sure. Especially if these buildings level up. Okay, road tiles better. Th We're never going to use a traffic light. So don't even keep that in your thoughts. Don't even think about using them. Because they are just bad. So what happens in endless mode... And maybe we'll try this with the next destination building. I'll show you uh, what happens when a building gets angry. You know, like in, in the other modes, um, when the building gets angry, you get the timer as we saw, and it's like blinking and it's upset and like, no, no, no. How dare you not take our passengers from these destinations? So yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go to fix that here shortly. See if we can get that to work for us. All right, We've got a new upgrade. So motorway, okay. So I think this is a good spot to get a motorway is disconnect this blue stuff. This is just no, just a nope, hard nope. And connect it over say here maybe. Let's see if we can move that down a bit. Get that connected there, okay, and much better. Okay. So the oh whoa 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 I disconnected. Okay, this is a good uh, time as any. So you see, it stays at five angry passengers the whole time. It doesn't do anything. There's no countdown timer. Even though I disconnected this on accident. Um, yeah, it's just gonna stay at that amount for however long we play this game because the game just doesn't end. That's why it's called Endless. It literally doesn't end. All right. Let's see if we can... Hopefully we can get a, little, a few more of these like blue-gray houses. That would be nice. Would be nice. And of course you can always move your motorways around if, if you need to see the buildings a bit better. Okay. Oh god, there's another one. Really? 
Wow. Okay. Sure, game. Let's just do that. <laughs> But I know that, like, endless mode, that kind of thing where you can just keep building your city has been requested I don't know how many times by people on my channel and other channels. It's like, absolutely must have, need, gotta get, you know, this kind of thing. Really, really important to people that we get that mode in the game. So I'm really happy that the devs added that. Um, it's going to make for some really interesting looking cities and where people can really focus on the city itself and getting the best traffic they traffic lines they can. Um, oh yeah, here we go. Okay, so let's just take... Uh, okay, can't do that. We have no bridges. Oh, okay. Can I go have a funny bridge? I have to have a funny bridge because I only have one bridge. All right, there we go. There we go. This one is already almost in angry mode. Okay, upgrade. The bridge. Another bridge. Okay, that's good. So now I could actually do cut the corner on that one if I wanted to, but it's okay. Why not just use one bridge? We don't need to have a second bridge made. Might as well use our resources more efficiently. Oh boy, this is a perfect spot for a, a roundabout, actually. Not a roundabout, a motorway. Sorry, not a roundabout. Okay, let's go this way. Let's turn that that way. Okay, so... Let's also place some extra tiles around these areas. Let's see, there we go. And kind of none there. Just do it like here. Don't want any right there and none right here either. Motorway, let's go. I feel like this is a good spot for a motorway, this blue area here. I'm going to take it off, just recycle our bridge, because this is high, or a very long length, and so therefore kind of a high um, priority area to, to smooth out here. And uh, just to, also, they, they travel a lot faster on the motorways, so very, very nice to get them organized a little bit better. Ooh, okay. So we have pink, more pink coming in hot over here. Let's just have space there. Okay, looking good, looking good. So far, nothing has gotten angry at us, so that's really nice. The shared yellow seems to work, be working quite well, as does this central hub of pink here. I know in the past I would be would have been tempted to be like, ah oh yeah, let's connect this pink here and then have a road going this way. But that would not be good for the traffic. So we're going to avoid that. Let's take another roundabout. We haven't had one in a while. We do actually have one bridge, so not too worried on that this i'm kind of surprised that this one and this one are getting so much traffic uh, we could take this one down uh add an extra yellow house but otherwise there's no more yellow houses that we can actually deal with uh oh you know we could i think we put another roundabout right here oh okay or not or not okay so what we need to do is at a roundabout somewhere here ish sure uh let's just delete and make these a little bit better okay and then okay this is kind of terrible but i suppose needed so now this yellow is sharing with all of these, all of these different destinations. Goodness me. Uh, 
Okay. Hmm. Certainly turned out to be an interesting map. Since these are connected, I think I'll save some road tiles and just connect this pink there. And save those, those bits and pieces there. Okay, this is going to connect to... Ooh. Can I go underneath this thing? Yes, I can. Oh, yes, I can. Boom. Okay, hopefully that'll work. We don't have a lot of blue houses, so... All right. There we go. The less... Less disruptions, the better. Better to have these weird star-shaped crossings than multiple crossings on a on a thing. But this is such a not a great not a great spot here. Definitely not. Of course if if this was too short we could have moved up the end of the highway a little bit further toward the gray houses there. That's another option that we had. Ah yes we have another oh okay sure we can go around like this with the blue houses. I forgot we had that one disattached or unattached. And these yellow ones we can take toward here. Did I miss something? What did I miss? I feel like it beeped at me and I'm like, I missed something. Okay, this one, hmm. Or around about there. Bridge, okay. I guess I could do a T junction here and then a T here if I wanted to. Oh dear, what have we got now? No! <laughs> what is this? Ah, uh, I didn't protect this road and it now spawned way too close. Oh god. Uh, okay. I guess we could try this. This is definitely not ideal. Definitely not ideal. No idealness in this land. Oops. Most of these buildings are two by three, so as long as I have specific like shapes here, and no two by three areas where it can spawn, it won't spawn. Okay, so what we can do is instead of having that happen, we can actually take this around like this and disconnect that from that. Yes, that is better. Okay. And then this mint green color is interesting. Get rid of this blue house. Ah, there we go. We can do that. Oops, no, no, no. This way. Thank you. Any more mint green? Nope. This one probably wants to go up there, but I don't want to connect it to this big network because it might go over here and that doesn't work at all. Okay. And now we have gray. Hmm. I don't know where I'm supposed to get the gray cars for this place. Or blue gray. I'm such a horrible person. I'm like, I'm leaving this shopping center abandoned. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> fine. No, the mall is complaining. Help. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we have upgrades. I forgot to check. All right, motorway. Let's go. You always should choose that as fast as possible because, as you can see, it doesn't, like, accumulate. It starts from zero again, so... 
All right, I think what we can do there is maybe we take... Wow, all of this, three houses going to there is not enough. Plus five houses? That's nuts. <laughs> I think we're going to take these off and take a motorway there. Uh, we'll take... Let's put this one here. Just go all the way across. There we go. And that one can have those cars. And this one will just have to survive on this tiny motorway over here. That motorway seemed like a long thing until we started motorway number three. Jeez. Okay, let's do some... Protection. Protection. Just want to space things out quite a bit here. Because... Whoops. It's getting a bit thick. Next upgrade. Roundabout. Good. Yeah, this one is surviving just with two two houses, which is kind of nice. We'll add that third one because it's not going to hurt. Oh, okay. All right, this one, let's connect that one there. The one thing I don't like in um, in this is that you don't get to keep track of how many trips you've done. And even though it's endless and yeah, technically, yeah, you could, um, you know, you could leave the computer on for days and days and whatever. I mean, you don't have to though. Like it's for you. It doesn't have to be on a leaderboard or something like that. So I feel like it would really be nice if you could just have, um, uh, endless, have, keep track of your trips, but maybe not put them on a leaderboard or something like that. I'm going to go ahead and disattach this one. It doesn't need to be attached there anymore. Um, because we have all these houses that would like to be part of this neighborhood now. All right. Very nice. So these only need to concentrate on this building now again. It's funny how the roadways have kind of evolved and changed and gone back to the way they were, sort of. That's a bit funny. Okay, and we also have more housing here. Uh, that would like to be included. Very nice. Nice. There we go. Is there some more blue happening? I don't think we need to connect it though. I think it's okay. Let's take another roundabout. I like the sounds. It's it's almost like a sort of electronic rain stick of sorts. It's it's interesting. I, I like it very much. So oops, this one. So there's more more houses popping up here and there. Looking good, looking good. But yeah, it's very chill and relaxed. Very chill. Do we want to attach that one? We kind of do, actually. Kind of do. Upgrade. Again, motorway. Okay, I'll take it. Love them motorways. So far, I don't have need of one, which is good. Though, um... I guess I could put a motorway right here to connect to this mint green building, but this mint green building, on the other hand, really doesn't need it right now. It doesn't seem like it does anyway. Uh, it seems to be okay with just, you know, cars coming out because there are a fair number of houses over here. But yeah, I would love to see how many passengers we'd, we'd actually delivered. So three bridges, let's have another roundabout then. But so far, not really needing any uh, any anything at the moment. We need some more buildings, I think. Though some of them are getting a little bit toward angry here. 
Some of them have grown into skyscrapers and that's a little bit taxing. For sure they need more, more people. They are growing very much. Okay, so let's take this out. We don't need the roundabout. Um, there we go. We don't actually need the roundabout. I wish they would increase their parking once they became skyscrapers. That would be nice. But it's okay. You know, you can't have everything. These poor houses. These are like gamer houses. We're like, like chilling in the middle of nowhere. We're like, eh, yeah. Let's have a land party. Let's do it. <laughs> so here we can actually have a new little colony here. All right, looking good, looking good. Some of them are getting a little bit full, I noticed, but let's see, is that one, that one's going that way. I guess it, uh, I guess I could do a second connection here if they wanna go that way. Cause they might, instead of going around and around this roundabout, they could just go upward depends on where they're going, I guess. They do seem to be choosing further. I think maybe what I do is I take these apart. Since there's this whole colony of gamers up here, let's take this off and take the bridge off as well. Cause we just need to connect to there and then red need, or pink needs to connect to there. These people are like, oh my God, what's happened to our city? What's going on here? <laughs> what is going on? So these now supply these two places, which is good. And this has its own little supply over here. And that way there's no confusion that happens with cars, uh, you know, crossing and whatnot. They don't need that anymore. So let's make this shorter even. Okay, so this is a new thing. We can also actually, maybe we can connect these here to help with the traffic a little bit. Though these might end up going to there, which would be a tiny problem. Just a tiny one. But we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it works. Should go that way. All right, I kinda think, kinda think we need to, to remove this and just have this one be that one. Just these three feed this one and those feed the others. I don't know why I connected them. That was kind of silly. Looking good though. Otherwise looking pretty good. These are getting still quite full and I don't really understand why. Unless it's because just too many cars on the same pathway. Could be. Maybe they do need a little bit of space to just help them kind of get on the road a little bit better. Let's see if we move these signs here, we can see what's going on a little bit better. Yeah, maybe three in a cluster is, is good enough. I don't know. They do slow down though, as you see, but it also makes it easier for them to get out. So maybe that's kind of what's needed. They are lessening a bit, this one and that one, I think. Not too much, but somewhat, I think. So yeah. I mean, technically what I could do is just divide. Oh, you know what? That's what I should do is I should divide them in half. Here, we'll divide them in half and separate. Yep, there we go. So we have three and three houses for each. That seems to be okay. Then they have their own dedicated road where there's a lot less traffic. Let's see if that helps the problem. Might, might actually. Yeah, it definitely is, I think. Let's see, are they getting less? Seems like they're getting a little bit less. They are skyscrapers, so they do generate a lot of passengers, but it looks like it's getting actually better. Look at this one, it's down to two and it was almost full before. So I think this is definitely the better solution with this. Definitely the better solution. Just separate them out and don't try to have too much in one area. Nice short routes here. That is super nice. Oh, I keep forgetting to click this thing. Okay, whoops. I wish it would like keep plinging at you, like ping, ping, 
or you know like showing the thingy because I think it's not going to evolve unless I click it so it kind of needs me to yep see now we're getting a lot of growth in here so I think this is it's better yep all right Looking very good. Well, I'm really happy with our city. I think it's looking absolutely fabulous. Um, as you can see, you can grow cities really big. Um, well, and you can keep on going and going and going. Um, and it's a really nice chill out kind of mode, the endless mode. And um, in the next episode, we are going to be doing the expert mode, which is very hardcore. And we'll see how we do. We might do another challenge. We'll just see how it goes. So, but anyway, I urge you to check out this game, find it on Steam. Um, it is a really, really fun game to play. Um, and again, this is the new Expert and Endless Mode. And uh, I hope you enjoy the uh, this game. I hope you enjoy all the new additions to it. So I just want to say thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.